Hey folks, in this short video, I'm going to show you how to use the switch to phone audio feature on Zoom. All right, let's get to it. So a really common problem that folks have in Zoom is they've got low bandwidth, and this causes a couple of noxious things to happen. One, it causes their videos to kind of get stuck or frozen or even blip out for a moment, and it makes the audio pretty much ununderstandable because it's constantly breaking out. There is not a ton that you can do about the video problem on low bandwidth, but there's a really good workaround for the audio. And so today I'm gonna to show you how to switch to phone audio while leaving your computer connected to the online video. That way those two data streams are joined and it allows a pretty functional zoom connection when you're in a low bandwidth setting. All right. so. Let's go ahead and get to it. All right, so the first step is you need to be logged into a Zoom meeting and you need to make sure that it's a Zoom meeting hosted by someone that allows you to use phone audio. From there, what you wanna look for is the little microphone icon, usually in the bottom left-hand corner of your Zoom. And if you click the little up caret next to it, it gives you this microphone window. And the option that you're looking for here is to switch to phone audio. When you click on that, it gives you one of the audio conference options. And again, what you want here is phone call. And what's handy is it gives you a phone number, a meeting ID, and a participant ID. So let's go ahead and try that out. All right, so I'm gonna dial the first number on the top here. So we got 669-900-6833. And let's go ahead and call that. Followed by pound. So I'm going to go ahead and enter the meeting ID that they've given me here. Keep in mind it'll be different for your sake. thing is instead of being connected on my microphone which is having bandwidth problems you can see that I'm connected on my phone and so the phone audio will then pick up what I'm saying relay it into the zoom call but it's not like I'm dialed in and connected as two different people I'm just me and you can see there that uh, it shows that I'm connected and talking from my phone so again this is a really great workaround for uh, folks with bandwidth problems and it makes it easy to be able to stay connected. I teach public speaking courses and when students are having problems giving their speeches, I just have them leave their cameras on, but dial in and this method works really, uh, really great. If you have a pair of AirPods or wireless headphones, this can be even more beneficial because it allows students the ability to kind of get away and kind of have a wireless lapel mic with, uh, with them. All right, well, I hope this was helpful. As always, if you have questions, put them in the comments. Otherwise, have a great day.